Mm, all right, great to have you. MM, you're welcome. Thank you. You're welcome, great to have you. Oh, so, yeah, uh, I saw something quite interesting yesterday on social media. Um, social media has been a, quite a very good tool when for correcting some ills of society. Mm -hmm. I tell you that society, social media in itself doesn't have any innate quality. It's like a blank page, like a mirror. Mm -hmm. What you throw in is what you throw out. So when you say, when you say, oh, it's toxic and all of that, I think that it's about who you follow, what is on your feed. Uh, it's uh, at the same place where you see that toxicity. Some other people see inspiration, mm -hmm. maybe see motivation, see yeah. love. So you know, it's see just money. see money. It's just a blank for me. It's just blank. Mm -hmm. You know, and whatever I hit in is what I hit out. So as much as it's been used, we know that a number of people also still put out a lot of funny details. Before I go to what, <laughs> let me tell you something. Before I go to what I want to talk about today, then let me tell you something. Somebody put out a video. I know this person. This person put out a video of, oh, God, I won't tell you exactly because you know the person. You know, put out a video of something that happened and said, oh, this, this happened. I was scammed. Oh, oh, my family did this. My family, my family. I've been away for this, 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 da, 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 da. This person, I've known that this person has been in Nigeria for over 15 years. <laughs> like, no, and then people just cry the story, oh, family, family can be evil. I know say family cannot be evil, because people have wish in their family, we know. But this was a lie. Exactly. And, and the person was, the person was just need to gain clout. And I knew that, I know, you do not just come back, you, you understand? I, because I knew the person, person, and I was like, I saw the reaction, I saw everybody was like, oh, family, family. But this was a lie. This actually reminds me of the conversation I was having with someone yesterday. And she outrightly said, people lie on social media. Mm. And to be honest, I had initially when she said it, it actually hit me. I'm like, oh, okay, how do you mean? By the time she started explaining, I now understood that people actually lie. Exactly, and there's some, t especially on TikTok, there's a content creator, when there are some things that happen, they just bring out a scenario. Ah, well, <laughs> so, but this one, I, I think many, many of you might have seen the video where a uh, uh, lady was calling out the vice president's daughter, as it were. Mm -hmm. You don't know what happened about how she had worked for one month mm -hmm. and she had not been paid what she was, in quotes, due. And then from, from the way she sounded, it seemed like she didn't even negotiate wasn't any pay. And, and she was expecting, and all, you, you, all through her, her video, you could hear things like, oh, I was expecting that this is the vice president's daughter. Maybe I could get something like, oh, some good money. And at the end of the month, nothing. <laughs> and I was given 15K for my transport. For working 31 days, you didn't work. You don't, nobody works 31 days in a month. I mean, how <laughs> and which month was it? Mike, stop it, you but yeah, <laughs> but you get. But the point is, she mm -hmm. went in there maybe without negotiating with that entitlement and all that. Does anybody do that? You go to an interview, or is that even sensible? Does that even make sense? Putting all of that together, are they being entitled and all of that? Does that, does that even make any sense in any way? I'll say, first of all. Right, I think the process of, I was literally, I've seen several videos of people actually talking about how when you're recruiting, especially as an entrepreneur or whatever, make sure you go through the right processes mm. of interviewing people. To me, it's coming off as if, okay, obviously, I don't think a proper process was of employment so was actually followed. Mm. It's a situation of, okay, I, have someone, I need someone to do this job. Well, yeah, who do you know? Who do you know? So, so I know this person, yeah, come, oh, president, you jump. Of course, see, the truth is, see. Even as entrepreneurs, right, when someone calls you to do a job, you, if you hear of the person's name, he's actually a notable person, you expect more mm. in this society that we're in. That's how things actually happen. So I'm sure she was excited at the fact that, ah, Vice President's daughter, let her be doing the work. Ah, no, bad as bad. And she said, now, did you say for 150k or 15k? And I said 150k. But then again, I think what struck me in the video was the fact that she actually said, the Vice President's daughter told her that, she, you know your job is based on commission, mm. right? And mm. now, okay, I would just give you 15K to sort out your transportation. To me, that came across as probably they had, yeah, a verbal conversation. Yeah. And they were prior meant to, to that time. Prior to that. And she was meant to do a job that was actually, she was meant to get commissioned for and all of that. So what it says is that for that month, she obviously didn't deliver on that. So she mm. wasn't entitled to any commission. And then you're expecting like a basic salary because everybody, she kept on saying everybody had been paid, everybody had been paid. Mm. And stuff like that. And then, but then again, what is important here is when you're going to a contract to work for someone, please let the terms be clear. Mm -hmm. Have a contract. All of you should sign, right? If you don't agree with it, you rest. Mm. So that's it. Avoids problems. Like I think that. that's the issue. Be sure. I mean, I mean, yeah. you've done. I mean, you've consulted and all that. I, imagine going into a con your consulting room and they're like, okay, ah, uh, when we finish the work, we'll I see. I think there was a lack of communication here. Mm. You know, looking looking at the scenario. Because there was something she said that sort of struck with me, and is she said she was paid that amount for mm. lack of performance. Oh, she said that. <laughs> yes. 
<laughs> lack of performance. That means she did not Deliver. meet up mm -hmm. to expectations. expectations. Mm. And that was why she was given that amount of money. And if every other person isn't complaining, that means every other person delivered on the job that they were supposed mm. to do effectively mm. and they were compensated or they were paid accordingly. But mm. she... Um, she didn't meet up. She flouted on whatever agreement that was, you know, made mm. from the inception. Mm. Hence, you know, the, 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 the monies she got. But what, now the, the question is, why coming on social media to cry foul? <laughs> is she trying to get attention from the vice president's daughter or trying to get um, attention from the public yeah. or trying to paint the vice president's daughter in a bad light? Oh, yeah. What her, her exactly. true intentions? intentions are? That's what they are now. First of all, I think the vice president has two daughters. Mm -hmm. eh? Which one? <laughs> Why didn't you just call the name first of all? Because so what, what, sure. what she was trying to do here yeah. was trying to, yeah. you know, sort of... Um, 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 sort of taint the vice president's yeah, yeah, rep daughter's yeah. reputation yeah, yeah. with this story, with, the, with her coming out on social media, because she could have easy, easily gone to the person or whatever. She could have had this conversation with the vice president's daughter, mm. and it could have been settled amicably. Not coming mm. on social media and crying for, am I going to be the one to now pay her for the monies that she was supposed to be paid for the job that she did not do well? She was now saying that she wanted to report, she, that if it was any other person, she could have reported to the police. Mm. But if, if that was her daughter, how can she report to the police? What would be done? Now, so she thing, also like, needs to properly just, even evaluate, sit down and properly evaluate the job that she did and ask herself mm. critically, did I do this job well? to mm. have been paid the amount that I am expected to be to paid. Do. And, and when I heard something about commission, my, my, my thoughts came that this is, the, a vice president's daughter is not an official position. You understand? She probably has a business where... Yeah, of course, like that a personal thing. With, it's not like, yeah. Yes, that has to deal with um, getting jobs and getting a commission, getting paid and getting... Yeah, so, that's the thing. so that definitely means like it's a personal business. So I don't think the issue of the person's... Parentage should be called into that question as at that particular point. Of course, that's so, so, so I think it's the same so, thing MM said. What exactly yeah, is she looking for? Exactly. Of course, trying to change her image so, and she's also trying to get uh -huh. to sympathy from the crowd. And I think um, employers do this as well. Yeah. When they want to employ like marketers, for instance, mm. and they know that marketing is something that you have to deliver, it's a delivery oriented job. Do you understand? Mm. They don't want to just pay you salary every month when you're not doing anything. So they tell you go out, whatever you bring in. We'll give you a commission from that. So from the sense of it, I think that was probably one of the, um, what the agreement was like. Mm. It was meant to be paid from what she brings in. And she didn't bring anything in. She even tried. She gave you 50k for transport. Yeah, Still talking about social media. Yeah. There was a girl that was recently called out on mm. Twitter. Mm. So this girl, I don't know in what capacity or what role she played at the UN. She was in the UN. At the UN. At the UN hall. Okay. Right? Then she does a video. Okay. And then in her tweets, she tweeted... Um, I was called, uh, called in a hurry to make a speech. That's why I am so nervous. Huh? And in the background, it was an empty hall. You can hear her voice echoing. Okay. So she did two different videos. Okay. And it was, the video was like, the camera was somewhere situated here where she was nervously asking her question. And then people came at her. Okay. First off, if you were to give a speech at the UN, you wouldn't be called abruptly. Mm -hmm. Secondly, it was a UN... This, these are people's comments, too, not okay. me saying it, too, because, like I said, she was called out. Oh, she's, she's actually really... Tre she's trend actually trending right now on social media because they were like... It, it, in all, it was a facade. Mm. And I see what she was trying to do. Mm. She is a climate, climate change advocate, advocate right? Okay. For whatever reason, she was at the UN, was personal to her. But then she decided to use that opportunity to what? You know, sell her market. Sell her market, mm. chase some clouds. You know, oh, just chase. Oh, oh, it's a fake oh. it till you make it oh. industry or world, I, I, actually. I, I, I mean, I was just called so, now. Exactly. <laughs> the conference a, a, over. Exactly. And people left the hall. Why people like this now? People should try to put this in perspective. <laughs> <laughs> like we said, so she made it seem like she was called, you know, um, um, impromptu, impromptu mm -hmm. to just make a speech mm -hmm. or to just say something. Mm -hmm. And then, you know, she and then she was holding her phone while she was, you know, making her speech. Obviously, according to her, she was nervous and all of that. And every people mm -hmm. tore that video apart, mm -hmm. you see, critically yeah. analyzed everything yeah. that could that possibly could happen, happen yeah. at a at a at a usual UN general, UN general meeting. Council. 
you know, all of it. I just want to mention that there is that pressure when you look at your phone. I have not posted in one really? month. Hey God, what do I post that will make that will make yeah, that'll gain that'll make, you know get some? <laughs> I need to move and all. I simply content creator. There's one guy. I don't know where he's a friend. I went to MM school. That guy <laughs> went to UK. That talk. I went to UK. I go to church today. They go give me phone. I go to church. Oh God! Not only you, they go. They get story like that. Story, story, tell story, story. You, 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 you want to create content? You now, you now go back. Give us Zobo, Dodo, all join. Anyways, be careful what you actually just, see ah! on social media and what you believe from social media. At this point, send in your comments. Let us know exactly what you oh. think about these topics. We definitely want to hear from you. We'll go on a quick break right now. When we come back, so much more to come right here. Make up <laughs>